All right, so for, from knee on belly, this is exactly what I want him to do. I'm drawing his arms out to open up his arm here. What I do is I step out a little bit. I hook right behind his shoulder and right behind his neck. And I throw my legs over and, and clamp right onto him. I'm not loose at all. I'm clamping. I'm nice and tight. So wherever he moves, I move with him. He's carrying all my weight, all my weight. And I'm just relaxing. The key to making this work is holding onto his shoulder. Because if I don't hold this shoulder, he's gonna escape, exactly. He's gonna get his arm in and escape. I usually like to have the shoulder up a little bit higher so it takes away his leverage. Because as soon as his elbow comes above his shoulder, he has no leverage. His leverage is here. Yeah, that's where it's at. Here, yeah, he's not going anywhere. From here, I hold this elbow. I take my hand, I fold and go right on his wrist. I don't need any, any strength to finish this. I, look, I use one finger. I just pull and there's the, there's the shoulder lock. One finger. Now, if by chance he gets out, a lot of the bigger guys, they'll start to roll to their, to their knees. If I let go, as soon as they roll, look what I do, I roll with them, and now I got a nice triangle. Thank you, Steve. So right from here, knee on belly, draws his arms out, I pick him up, slide my leg under, whip my other leg over and clamp right to his hip, holding right here at his shoulder. As I mentioned, I get his elbow above his shoulder, which takes away the tension or his leverage. I fold the arm. I could grab here and pull. I just one finger and pull. It's, it's a lot of tension on his shoulder. From here, if he gets up to his knees, I kind of rotate with him. And I'm grabbing both his arms. From here, there's the triangle. You guys see that all right? All right, guys. One more time, Jack. One more, one more time? time? One more time. One more time. Just make sure. First, pick him up and just grab the back of his neck. Yeah, I'm grabbing the yeah. back of his neck and I'm grabbing behind his shoulder. So I'm kind of lifting him off the mat. So here, see how I hook okay. just like this? I hook him and I slide under and throw my leg over. I like this clamped and pinched to his hip. Really tight and I'm biting, pinching my knees. So he can't move. From here, I fold his arm right on his wrist. I slide up to his, his elbow and I start to push the wrist and pull the elbow. That's the shoulder lock. As soon as he starts to rotate on me, he kind of uses his arms to help me rotate. And there's the, there's the triangle. Is that good, Leo? Yes, sir. All right, guys, one, two, three.